Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Keith, and I have to tell you, Darren Thornton knocked me senseless this weekend. Senseless, I tell you. Darren Thornton, of course, is the director of the new film A Date for Mad Mary, which I had the opportunity of seeing at the Ottawa Irish Film Festival. Now, if you've never been to the Ottawa Irish Film Festival, you definitely want to make sure you catch it next year. They show a lot of great films, and it's a wonderful treat, especially if you haven't seen some of these different movies before. They do a combination of old and new, so it's, it's, it's great to come out to. But let's get back to Mr. Thornton, shall we? He hit me and knocked me senseless this weekend. First, he hit me with the left, and the left, of course, was the performance of Shauna Kerslake. Shauna plays Mary, and Mary just got out of prison. She's a bit of an acquired taste, as she's basically just doesn't care what anybody thinks. She's the type of person who shows up to the bar in running shoes and is always ready for a fight. Now, it doesn't help the fact that her best friend's about to get married, and she's supposed to be the maid of honor. And it also doesn't help that the maid of the, the bride, excuse me, has already told her what she wants her to say in her speech. That's when Darren hit me with the right, and the right was Charlie Bailey. Charlie ba Bailey plays the bride in this movie, and her performance is so good, and you look at it, and everybody's met a character like her before at a wedding. It's true, I know I have. Her performance is so subtle, but so integral into how and why Mary is the way that she is. So after he hit me with the left and he hit me with the right, I thought, okay, Darren Thornton's gonna leave me alone. Nope, not so fast. That's when he brought in the uppercut, and the uppercut is Tara Lee. Tara Lee plays Jess. Now, Jess is a very interesting character in her own right because she pretty much acts as the new person who's come into Mary's life. Her and Mary keep bumping into each other, and then they form a friendship, so it's very nice. So all of a sudden, in this world of chaos that Mary is living in, she comes across this person who just kind of like helps her bring it down a little bit. Now, what I really loved about this fantastic movie, directed again by Darren Thornton and also written by Darren and Colin Thornton, is the fact that it doesn't try to get your attention. It doesn't try to make you love it. You just end up loving it because it is such a good movie. It doesn't go out and seek your attention, but, you, but it gets your attention because it is such an original piece of art. When I think about this film, I think about a handful of change. And you've got a handful of change and you look in and you see that really shiny coin that stands out from the others. That's how I feel about this movie compared to other movies that I've seen recently. There's just something really special about it that stands out. The frustrating part is because it's screening at different festivals right now, it hasn't had its North American release. But they tell me, and when I say they, I mean the director, that this film is supposed to be released end of summer, early fall. So when it comes out, be sure I'll be tapping you on the shoulder to remind you. I also had the opportunity of interviewing one of the stars, Tara Lee. For those of you keeping track, that was the uppercut. And um, so be sure to look out for that interview as well. This is a wonderful film. I give it a B plus. When it comes out, again, I will remind you, that's my job. And then you go and see it. And that's your job. And then you come back and high five me because you're going to love it. Because I thought it was great. As always, if you need to get a hold of me, please do. CFL underscore fan on Twitter. Facebook.com slash Witty Whittier and Witty Whittier.com. Mr. Thornton, I want you to know that I won't be pressing charges against you, but I will be giving you a virtual high five, a virtual fist bump, and saying thank you for making such a great film. I thoroughly enjoyed it, and I wish you, you and all the cast and crew all the best. My name is Keith, and until next time, I'll see you at the movies.